Yew! Good everyone, I'm Saltwater Steve. Just to kind of give these guys a quick fit, um, feed. It's Fishy Friday for me, everyone. I finish work early on a Friday, or I try my best to come home and I clean out all the fish tanks. So this one's had a water change, we've done inside. And I'm just gonna give these guys a feed and then shoot over to the um, fish doctor's house to pick me up a long-spined urchin. I'm hoping he's getting, there we go. Look at the chief guy hanging out there. You wanna share that, mate? All right, I'm gonna take his round and when, see he's at the fish doc's house when we grab this spiny urchin. Here we are, salty fam. What I left out for us. How cool is that? That is a big one. We're gonna transfer it into our bucky. And then we'll see us back at home. You, you. we're back home, salty fam. Here he is, I'm gonna get him acclimated. He's got some cool blue on him. I don't think you'll be able to see it, but my goodness, he's awesome. Can't wait, hopefully he cleans up a bit of the mess and at least I know nobody's gonna eat him. But while I'm acclimating him, I'll show you a bit of inside, then I might feed Spike and Elon, and tomorrow you can come with us and we'll go check out Ocean Reef, see if we can find something cool. Maybe more cleanup crew, who knows mate, it's always a mystery there. You. All right, salty fam, this is my inside tank. It's an Aqua 1, 160, three footer. Let's chuck a bit of food in. Pretty sure I told you last week, the banana ass had been getting bullied by my damsel, the pink and yellow, wherever that is. Such a mean fish. And it, it, it jumped out, pretty sad. Hopefully it's gone, that'd be nice. I can't see it. How good would it be if something's happened to it and someone's bashed it and put it in its place? <laughs> Honestly, I can't see it, so who knows? But he jumped out. No one oh no, there it is. Wishful thinking. <laughs> but comment down below which tank you like the best. The outside fowler? This inside reef, or even if he's like Elong and Spike, bettest. I'll take his out there and show you, give them a bit of a feed. Now, will we see you out there? G'day. Hi, Spike. Show us your trick. And Elon, how you going, mate? Give us a little, yes. Can you get the phone? Go on. Go on, Spike. Shoot it at me. That's it. And again. Okay. Come on, guys. Okay. Shoot some water. Get a little water. Oh, I see the water. Did I get it? Good boy, Spike. Good boy, Spike. More for Spike. Oh, a little bit down there. See if Elon gets that. He can't really see. Elon's partially blind for those that don't know. Oh, that was a good one, Spike. Yeah, yeah, go, Elon. The little fishies that hit. Yeah. And he's in, salty fam. Ready? How cool. Luna. Aramundi cod or panther groper. Fu Manchu. Mr. Scribble. Pintail trigger. Make sure you hang around now, guys, and I'll see you at um, Ocean Reefs and we'll see what they've got there. You! You! We're at Ocean Reefs now, guys. Check out the display as usual. This is a beast. How nice. So 
So many nice little pieces. The more you look at it, the more you see. Couple of nems in this tank, don't you think? Nem crab. Oh, it's a sexy shrimp. Where? Oh, yeah. Couple of new nano displays set up. How cool are these? And then one right next door. Nice NT reds in, I'm sure that's what they are. Oh, I might have to get me one of them for $30. I like. Oh, the colours still don't come up as good. Hopefully they do at home. Alright, let's go over and check out the fish and see if they've got any extra cleanup crew for us to get. Scullies. Oh, oh my goodness. This is a unique fella. I haven't seen him here before. There you go, mate. I'll find out what you are and I'll put it on the screen for you. Because you, my friend, are a bit of a dude. I'm thinking I might get one of these cucumbers, guys. What do you reckon? Yep, I think that's a yes. I wonder if there's anything in that shell. If there is, I might get whatever's in that too. Very unique. We've already got an orange one though. Got a shark. I might get one of these guys too, they're unique looking. One of them. And we'll find out what this thing is. I might get him too. Oh look, I'll clean the glass and we'll check out this little cut. So guys, this is a harpoon snail. Pretty much like the cone shell. So I don't think he'll be any good inside. And apparently these will get eaten and make a mess of our tank. So we don't want to get them either. What a shame. The joys of having a predator tank and trying to get clean up crew. How cool is this little guy? I really like him. I want him to change colours. So we can keep him. <laughs> Dude. Come over. Hey, you go, mate. What's your name? Are you camouflaged? <laughs> you are a cool dude. So is this guy. Hello? What are you doing, mate? I don't know. If he was a little bit smaller, we could probably get him for ours. Heaps and heaps of file fish in. Some of them have awesome colours. My guy. Bluey green. We got this um, hogfish. He's got some cool colours too. I wonder if we should get him. He's not very predator tankish, but he is good for, oh, Mr. Scribble, cleaning the sand bit. The beloved flathead perch. 
Hopefully we end up with one of these one day. They are very rare for aquarium fish. But they are very expensive. One day though, we might end up with one. We have to sweet talk Simon. What a dude. Spewing that little triggers to it so small. He was a bit bigger. I'd be getting him too. All right, salty fam. So we got this fella, go fish. We got a nice rasper inside and that cool little morph. Hopefully you've enjoyed this one, guys. If you did, I mean, this is what this place looks like. It's ginormous. How good. That's a wrap for this one, salty fam. If you've enjoyed it, don't forget to like and subscribe. But until next time, stay, stay salty. salty. You. you.